at this point. It's very safe to say that I'm obsessed with the internet. Lots of paper plates. We definitely need these. Oh my gosh. I bought vanilla for like baking or whatever. I don't know why I'm unboxing this inside here. I bought two foam cases and I bought what else? I bought this jump rope because as we know it I've started working out more and so my sister was telling me that you burn a lot jump roping so I bought this for I think four dollars or so on Amazon and then I bought one phone case from my mother for the iPhone 11 Pro Max this one doesn't exactly tell you which one of the phones it's for but specifically, okay, yeah, 11 Pro Max, so for my mom. I'm gonna just open it and drop it. Oh, this one is such a soft one. Not the ones that I love because she, my mother's like a child with the phones, honestly. And then I bought these two for myself. I don't know how protective they are. I like it. It's so cute. This is what the back looks like. This is so cool. Oh, this comes with a privacy screen. What do you know? Just a regular um, tempered glass. I think that's so cool that they send it with it because these cases are literally so cheap. And that is dope. I think I'm going to put this one on. I'm going to put it on first to make sure that the little buttons and stuff work. But, you know, I wouldn't be me if I wasn't out here on the internet, but oh, I love it. This one says, follow your passion. This one says, love the life you live. And I feel like they're both so cute. And I have two tempered glass. So that's pretty cool. And I'm definitely going to still keep this case here because I get really bored with the cases easily. So I'm going to keep that one. And um, I'm going to put one of this little clear thing on the back because this is on the back of all of my phone, literally. Just now when I was coming home, I went out the block and we bought some fried chicken. We felt like having some fried chicken. So we did just that. And that was really good. We started eating on the way back too. But um, I'm going to just use the time to kind of allow this to sit on here while maybe I watch some Netflix or something like that. I don't really know. Today's Monday, 
not my day off. I actually have to work, but I wanted to start the day with doing laundry and a workout simultaneously. So I'm going to go on a walk while I put my clothes in the washing machine at the laundromat. I was thinking about dropping them off, but then I'm just like, yeah, no. I'm going to wash them myself. So I'm going to put them in the washing machine, go for like a 30 minute walk because they're going to wash in like 30 minutes and then come back, change it, walk again, and then um, maybe wait for them to be done, come home, sleep, and go to work. That's the plan. All right, we'll see how that turns out. Tell me how I decided to start my day early and the universe is literally working against me in the sense where like I'm outside trying to do a little walk considering the fact that I literally have like a few things going on today and of course now that I've actually opted out of the walk and decided to come do some jump ropes it stopped drizzling so now I'm wondering because this jump roping is hard I'm wondering if I should just continue the walk I have at least uh, 20 minutes before I have to like go back and change the clothes. So I'm wondering if I should continue the walk and then um And then go swap the clothes over into the dryer and Probably walk again. I don't really know but like today I'm determined to get some form of workout and I'm not trying to slack Oh So far so good back to the laundromat to take my clothes out of the washer and like put them in the dryer and stuff well no not take them out of the washer and put them in the dryer they're already in the dryer so i need to take them out because they're pretty much done at this point and like fold them up and come home i managed to body a couple of workouts i started off going for an outdoor walk and then it was drizzling a little bit so i started some jump rope and then it stopped drizzling so i continued the walk and i came home and did like a little booty workout and now I'm here to go back for my clothes and see if I can sleep before it's time to go to work. Not that I feel tired or anything, but I'm going to shower, put my hair up and see if I can get... I didn't even eat yet. I'm going to have to eat. Oh, God. I'm going to go to the laundromat.